Hello guys, my name is Vedit. So today we are going to discuss about the, the rank functions. Uh, like we have the row number rank and dense rank. So all three are the Windows functions basically used to get the uh, like if you want to get any uh, sequences of the of your uh, table rows based on either you are you can do the partitioning of the data or you can perform the order by command there so uh, just let's understand it what is the row number what is the difference between rank and the dense rank so i am having a temporary table here in a snowflake i am doing it in a snowflake okay you can try it in other sql also so that would be fine and that should work same in all the sequels <coughs> so I'm having a table here um, here basically having this department and salary things and just creating this table first I'm entering few records here so this is my sequence and uh, these like the employees you can say and they have the different different department with their salaries let me insert that we have the eight records here and let's see yeah we have the records here right okay so now um, we will apply the row number we will apply the rank and we will apply the dense rank and we'll see what is the actual difference basically <laughs> So this is my next uh, command here let's suppose I'm applying the row number so I'm not partitioning yet I'm just uh, applying those things uh, uh, like order by I'm applying here I'm not partitioning yet let's see what the result we are getting so we are using the row number here then rank and the tense rank and we'll see the differences so if I try to execute it you will see uh, row number is exactly working like for all the rows as we have this order by department here so as we are applying the order by so it is giving like one two three and the next number up to eight so it is giving if we look into the rank function so you can see uh, let's suppose this is the HR first then IT and then we have the marketing right so the rank is basically working like 1 1 1 1 for the HR then it is coming to the fourth because all three numbers has been taken here so the next is the fourth so 4 4 4 and 4 so there are total six records here so this four has been assigned to the IT department and the next number would be the seventh one because all we can see like the six six records has been taken till here you can see the row number and the seventh number has been assigned to the marketing one in the same way a little difference between this dense rank which we know like it basically continue with the next number not the uh, not the actually the row number which we are getting here so you can see all three records are getting the dense rank as one and the next would be the two and after this it one the next would be the three like that it is not like uh, we have taken three numbers here and next would be the four which will come into the rank only so um let's suppose if i change something here and if i apply the partition by partition by department and order by i can place here with the salary we order by use this with salary and same thing i am applying here partition by department order by salary and same thing let's suppose i applying here partition by 
department and order by salary and let's apply it now and let's see the differences okay so let's see the first is the row number so you can see uh, we have partition based on the department so this is the department we have partitioned so uh, as now we have the three department here IT marketing and the manager right so it has creating the three partitions so now how it is no row number is working it is just looking into the department IT first and it creating the number like one two three it is telling layer there are three employees under the department of IT the second one is marketing there are two employees and the third is the HR there are three employees here okay let's look at the rank now now we have a difference here as we have put the order by as a salary right so it basically look or uh, matching the records here so rank is having the uh, for IT department the salary is 10 right so it when it uh, it is giving the rank 1 but for other record it is giving the same rank which is 2 because both the salaries are same right so it is giving the rank 2 this is the same thing is happening in the case of the dense rank as well as we have put the order by as um, this one salary and because the salary here the same so the dense rank is 2 okay now it doesn't mean like the for the next number the rank will start from the fourth or the dense rank will start from two or three something no we have applied the partition so that thing will apply applicable inside that partition part only so after that if are moving we can see the rank here one and two right in the same way in the dense rank you can see the rank is applying here as for this uh, let's say marketing we can see one sixty thousand and two for seventy thousand right okay and for HR we can see here you can see both HR is having the same salary and this uh, the third one this employee is having the different salary more salary so in case of the rank you can see this partition is having one one and then it is having the three right as per the rank it will have the number three because one and two has been covered here so the next number would be the three one but in case of the dense rank as we know it it will give the same num it is giving the same number here one and one and will start from the next number which is what we, which would be one plus one equal to two the next would be the two number right <clears throat> so this is a silly difference we see here a uh, very little difference so we can uh, see this here and can apply it okay so let's um, if you want to change something you can apply that change let's suppose you want to order by department only so let's see is the change so here you can see if we apply this as per the department row number is again working one two three one two and one two three how many records under comes so it will give the different rank different number to each one but as we have applied the order by with the department and the de partition is also happening with the department so so that's mean we are we are uh, giving the same rank to the all of the records you can see one 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 like that so this is very uh, simple difference between the rank dense rank and the row number and there are various use cases which we where we use uh, these window functions uh, like we are deleting the duplicate records if you want to especially provide some ranks and uh, show want, want to show that record on the UI or something 
so there are several use cases for these windows function so thank you so much for this time i will upload my next video soon in the snowflake thank you